today we're going to be doing a what's in my bag video. So if you guys are interested in hearing about what's inside my speedy Bandelier 30, then please keep on. I actually posted a little poll on my Instagram asking you guys what you guys want to see on my YouTube channel. And someone said a what's in my purse. That's exactly what we're doing today. So yeah, this is my speedy Bandelier 30. I got this purse a few years ago back in 2019 and I'm obsessed with it. The size is perfect. It literally fits your whole life and I love how versatile it is. Like you can wear it with the straps, you can wear it with the handles here. It's so cute and it goes with every single outfit you have. I get so many compliments on this purse and I love it. So if you guys are thinking about buying this purse, I highly recommend, especially in this color because you literally cannot see any wear and tear from it. Like, it literally looks brand new. It will look exactly the same from when I bought the purse, everything about it. And yeah, the only thing I will say is the lock actually changed a bit. I post when I first started my YouTube channel how I clean my lock. Um, it's a solution called Brasso. You guys can look at that video if you guys are interested. But it cleans it really, really well. So if you guys have the same issue with your lock, I definitely recommend Brasso. This is going to be a very accurate what's inside my bag because I haven't even checked. Like, I've been wearing this bag throughout the last few months. And, like, whatever's inside here is literally what I carry every single day. So I just carry the same thing in every single purse that I have. Um, so, yeah, this is basically what I have. So let's just open it up. So I do have a purse organizer. This is from Amazon. And I'm the type of girl that doesn't really like a bulky purse organizer. I don't like when my bag looks really bulky. That's just something personally I don't like. So I found this one from Amazon a while back. Super like not bulky and I really, really like it. So this is how my purse looks. It has the red interior and we're just gonna pull out some stuff in here. I always moisturize my hands. So I always have a hand lotion in my purse. That's just something that's a must for me. Like I need to have moisturized hands at all time and every single purse that I have I have a little makeup bag so I actually got this from my mom she got it in a little like perfume set makeup bag and it's like a velvet material it's really nice I like how it matches my purse so that's why I always carry this purse I really really like it it's a perfect size it fits like all my makeup that I need for every day so I really really like it and it has a gold zipper so I usually just keep my everyday like essentials that I need to like touch up my makeup or whatever um, so the first thing that I have is my say brush That's what I keep in there. I also do have my Charlotte Tilbury airbrush brightening flawless finish powder This is the one that I use usually just to touch up my face. So I have that I do have the Charlotte Tilbury airbrush finish in the color too. This is what I like to use to give my face some color if I'm oily I also do have my everyday lip gloss. This is the Patrick Ta, what is this called? Major Volume Plumping Gloss. This is my favorite. I love the color. This is in the color 2CCs and it is so nice. I love the way it feels on my lips. It's amazing. I have an eyebrow pencil. This is the one size Brow Kiki in medium brown just to touch up my brows if I need to. Um, I have some eyelash glue just in case I wear false a lip liner. This is the Patrick Ta She's Bold Lip Liner. I usually use this as my everyday combo. And that's pretty much everything I have in my makeup bag for my purse. I just carry like minimal stuff just to like upkeep my makeup throughout the day just to make it look fresh. So I have that. Thing that I have in my purse is my wallet. So I actually have the Louis Vuitton Clemence wallet. This is in the pink interior. Um, and I have just all my cards in here and everything. I actually do have a video on this on my YouTube channel when I got it a few years ago. If you guys are interested, I love it. And I love that they are matching. I love anything matching, you guys know. Yeah, I just have my cards in here, all my little, my little stuff. I am Canadian, so I have some Canadian cash in here. If you guys have never seen Canadian cash, this is how it looks. I know I have some European, um, subscribers so this is how the Canadian bill looks and then this is the other one as well oh, is that the right way there we go <laughs> so yeah I think our um, money is really pretty but 
Anyway, so that's basically what I have in my wallet. And I have is some lip products. So I always make sure to keep some lip products on me. Oh my gosh, I have so many. I'm just like looking at them. So I have this Too Faced Lip Injection Extreme Lip Gloss. I actually don't wear this often just because I find it really irritates my lips. Like I got this a while ago and I just, I've kept it in here and I still have it in here. Um, yeah, I don't really wear this often. I just kind of have it in my purse. Um, just to have it, but I don't wear it often. I also have the Summer Fridays Lip Butter Balm in the color Pink Sugar. I really love Summer Fridays, such a nourishing lip balm. And then I also have the Nivea one in case I'm not wearing makeup and I just want some moisturized lips. So that's basically what I have there. I also do carry, um, just checking the pockets, I like to carry hand sanitizer with me. So I have the Bath and Body Works Snowy Peach Berry one. This smells so good. I love a hand sanitizer that smells good. So I always make sure to have this in my purse. I am a gum queen. Like I think I have 20 packs of gum in each of my purses. I just like love gum so much. I always need gum. So I have literally like so much gum in this purse. Honestly, this isn't even that much. I usually have a lot more. So I have my XL gum in here. And then I just have some feminine products, which is not interesting. I'm not gonna show you guys that. And that is pretty much it. And then I also have my brush as well, which is gross. I'm not gonna show you guys the other side because it is full of hair and I need to clean it. I to brush my hair throughout the day. So I always make sure that I have my brush in here and I'll show you guys how my purse looks right now. So it's very empty. I usually will put like perfume or something in my purse or like a spray or something just to have. But that's basically what I carry from day to day. Like I don't really have much in my purse. Um, I don't like when my purse is like too heavy either just because I do carry my purse like everywhere with me. So I don't like when it's like super heavy. But yeah, that is basically everything I keep in my purse. This is the organizer that I have. So this is how it looks. It's super thin, as I mentioned. I don't like a bulky one. And this was from Amazon. And yeah, I just don't like when it's too bulky and makes my purse like very, very big. How? My purse looks on the inside. Um, the inside is very clean. I have this purse since 2019 and I feel like it is in mint condition and I'm not that careful with my purse. Like I'm really not overly like careful with it and I feel like it's like in mint condition. Like if you were thinking about getting this purse, I highly recommend it. It is a safe bet because it literally looks brand new. Like just everything about it, um, even the hardware, like the gold, I feel like it looks still so good. The bottom of the purse, everything oh yeah that is everything that i keep inside my speedy bandolier 30 i really hope you guys enjoyed today's video and i'll see you guys in my next video